Hello guys, what is up? It is Cameron back once again bringing you guys a new review and today we're going to be reviewing a speaker system that comes to us from Thana and Vander and this is their lot speaker system. It retails on Amazon for $99.99 so if you're interested in checking it out, visit the link in the description down below. But without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into this review and I'll tell you if these speakers are worth your money. Alright, so let's start off by taking a look at what comes in the packaging if you do decide to purchase these speakers. Now the first thing you're going to get is the power cable. Um, it plugs directly into the speaker so you're not going to get any type of power or anything like that which I really really like the next thing that you're going to get in the packaging is going to be your user's manual and quick start guide and it just basically tells you how to use the speakers how to get them up and running so you might want to take a look at it but you probably won't need this and then finally the last thing that you're going to get is the Thana and Vander branded RCA cables now these have the left and the right channel audio as well as an aux output 3.5 millimeters so you are able to plug it into your laptop or your phone or any other device uh, and you know output music directly to these speakers uh, the cables are actually really high quality though so I really really like that they have their own branded ones. Now let's take a look at the speakers themselves. As you can see you're going to get three different units. The middle one has the subwoofer and all your controls and then you are going to have your left and your right channel speakers that have your tweeters in them. Um, the build quality of these is exceptional. They feature very high quality uh, tough plastic and then you are going to get a metal grill cover on the front to cover up the speakers. I think they look very good aesthetically. Um, I like the design and they construction wise they feel very high quality. Um, you don't feel like you're going to break them very easily or anything like that so that's always good but taking a look at the main unit let's look at what comes on it if you look at the very side you're actually going to get your external controls and these are great because you're actually able to control the volume the treble and the bass right from the speaker so it really allows you to customize the sound to your liking um, so if you're for instance watching TV or something you might want to turn the bass down but if you're listening to some kind of like you know rap music or hip-hop or something like that you might want to turn the bass up uh, and the treble down so it really allows for you to customize your view or your your listening experience um, you know depending on what kind of uh, content you're actually consuming if you move around to the back of the speakers you can see that you are going to get several different inputs you are going to get your speaker outputs at the very top on the left and this allows you to output audio from this main unit to your left and your right channel speakers um, pretty easy to set up no issues there and then you are actually given the option for two different inputs you can have input one and input two and then if you look at the bottom, you can see that you are going to get your power switch and then finally your input for your power. Then also on the very back, you're going to get the airport, you know, for the base to come out of uh, because the subwoofer is located in this unit. Now let's take a listen to a little bit of an audio test of these speakers. Keep in mind, though, that this is recorded with my Blue Snowball microphone. So it's not going to sound exactly like it does in real life, but it will give you, you know, an idea of the power of these speakers. Um, in person, they sound really, really good. And through the microphone, they do sound good, but just keep in mind that it is not a super accurate representation of these speakers and their quality. So let's take a listen. Alright guys, so I'm going to wrap up this video and give you guys my final thoughts on these speakers. I think the audio quality for these speakers is exceptional, especially for the $99 price tag. I really like the bass on these. It sounds good and I've never had any issues with the mids and the highs. They sound great as well. So no matter what kind of genre of music you're listening to, these speakers can really provide the audio quality that you're looking for, uh, especially for their $99 price tag. And then the construction of these speakers is also really great. You know, it features the uh, hard plastic and the, the metal grill cover on the front. So I think build quality wise, these are all also very very good for their you know under a hundred dollar price tag um, I really don't think you can go wrong with these for any type of listening experience whether you want these just for your room listening music or hook it up to your, like your TV you know for your audio setup out there um, I've used these at football tailgates and they sounded great. Um, we played music and we've also used it on our TV to watch football and I've really had no issues whatsoever with that. So I think that these are great for any type of use that you might want to use them for. So honestly, these are my favorite speakers under $100 right now. I think these are exceptional um, in audio and build quality, so I cannot recommend them enough. So if you're interested in purchasing them, visit the link in the description down below to the Amazon page and you can check them out more and decide if you want to buy them. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more content leave a like rating if you did enjoy this video and let me know what i can do better or if i did everything great in this video in the comment section below but thanks for watching hope you guys did enjoy and i'll catch you in my next video see ya